Colors of Freedom is not a definitive historical show. The curatorial intent is to provide a short glimpse of the overall visual space shaped by 75 years of freedom. We have included excerpts from two landmark films, featured textiles, indigenous subaltern art, and of course some veteran and young Indian artists across generations from post-independent India. The experience is meant to be holistic and a celebration of the creative diversity and freedom of this vast country. We start with a few excerpts of Pothet Pachali by Shuttujit Rai, which is also a homage to the filmmaker on his centennial year, accompanied by Hussain's take on Ray's Pothet Pachali. Young Shuttujit of the time was greatly inspired by the neo-realist ideas of Italian filmmaking. It was all about shooting outdoors in the midst of real life by relatively unknown actors coming from ordinary life. He taught us to look differently at cinema and his cinematic experiments impacted the artistic and cultural nuances of India hugely. We have placed veteran Bikash Bhattacharya as well in this section as his source of inspiration remains the same. Bikash was equally inspired by the neo-realist ideas of Bicycle Thief, a film by the Italian director Vittoria De Sica Bikash's works also talk about the ordinary and the hapless in their real life surroundings, occasionally bordering on magic realism. Pass next through works by the generation of 50s to 80s, a period of eclectic modernism. The first phase being essentially figurative and gradually leading to a zone of soul abstraction.
The exhibition now leads on a few postmodernist experiments by the generation of 90s and early 2000s. Finally, we move into a phase dominated purely by millennials. In between, we also have a glimpse of a few excerpts from the film Sholay from 1975. It changed the face of Indian cinema as never before and impacted visual art as well. While we have selected some leading veteran modernists, we have also featured seminal works by relatively rarely exhibited artists, unknown weavers, and daring visual renderings by subaltern and indigenous masters. <laughs> Indian art has imbibed the essence of various cultures and civilizations and created a fascinating visual vocabulary which is uniquely its own. This we notice across creative genres, crafts, weaving, cinema and of course visual arts as well. Colours of Freedom is all about celebrating that wonderful amalgamation of ideas, forms, iconography and colours, resulting in a unique and magical experience.